water pollution. Water is one of the most valuable resources provided to us by nature. We use water for so many purposes and while doing so, we also make water very dirty. Making the water dirty by the addition of substances called pollutants is called water pollution. Let us try to learn more about water pollution and how we can reduce it. Many human and natural activities result in water pollution. Dumping garbage into water bodies is a common cause. Washing clothes, utensils and bathing animals add dirt and detergents to the water and cause pollution. Untreated waste from factories and sewage from residential areas add toxic chemicals and waste into the water bodies. Water that is washed off from agricultural fields contains large amounts of pesticides and fertilizers that pollute the water of the nearby water bodies. Accidental spillage of oil from oil mining machines into the sea and oil carrying ships is a growing cause of water pollution in the present times. On January 28, 2017, two cargo ships collided off the coast in Chennai, causing a massive oil spill into the sea. This caused a lot of damage to the aquatic plants and animals. Drinking polluted water can cause diseases like typhoid, cholera and diarrhea. Metals like lead, mercury and arsenic present in polluted water enter the bodies of aquatic organisms like fishes. When humans drink this water or eat the organisms living in such polluted waters, there is a high risk of lead and mercury poisoning. Arsenic poisoning causes black patches on the skin and prolonged exposure can even cause cancer. Addition of waste and toxic chemicals to water also raises the temperature of water by many degrees. Rise in temperature alters the life cycle of many aquatic organisms and can even kill the plants and animals living in water. Water pollution has serious effects on us and our environment. So, what can be done to reduce it? One very easy way is to educate people to stop dumping garbage, washing clothes and bathing animals in water bodies like lakes and rivers. Waste from industries and residential areas should be treated and made free from harmful substances before being discharged into water bodies. Use of harmful pesticides and insecticides in agricultural fields must be discouraged. We too should do our duty and avoid wastage of clean water.